curling, comb out a two inch subsection of hair to work with. Next, comb through your subsection, making it nice and smooth and clean. Now, take the barrel of your curling iron while hot and smooth out the roots, getting it nice and smooth and clean. This will help the overall look of the curl. Once done, reestablish your subsection by combing through it, making it nice and clean again. Put the hair within the barrel, direct the hair to the handle, placing it over while clicking and turning. You may have to just reach over and grab it. Now pull it to the end of the curling iron, direct it over, and now as you click and turn, you're going to want to try and get it to go into the center feed by pulling it over a little bit. While clicking and turning, make sure it stays in the center feed. Now you can click and turn and rotate. Keep clicking and turning until you hear a metal click. This will let you know that all the hairs went through the curling iron. Make sure your tension is great and to not let the curl fall too low. Try and stay parallel with the subsection and your curling iron. Now take your comb and comb off the hair from off the iron. Try and keep the curl in place, not to disrupt it. After the curl has cooled, twirl it down, break it up a little bit, and finger comb it through. This will help pronounce the curl and see how much curl you have. To establish more curl, wind the hair around your fingers and pin it up. Let it sit. I recommend doing this through all your curls until you're done.